During today's Prime Minister's questions, Jeremy Corbyn delivered a scathing attack on the weakness of Theresa May's government. Jeremy Corbyn once again seemed to get the better of his opponent in open debate. The leader of the opposition asked questions on last week's House of Commons vote on universal credit, the implementation of universal credit, the minimum wage and the record of the current government. During a bad week for the current Prime Minister, a forlorn-looking Theresa May struggled to gloss over the clear divisions in her front party, which were exposed by the Labour leader in damning fashion. Corbyn said the government's own Social Mobility Commission reported that low pay was endemic in the UK. One in four workers permanently stuck in low-paid jobs. That's why Labour backs a real living wage of £10 per hour to make work pay. This government doesn't know whether it's coming or going. The Conservative Party and the government say they have full confidence in universal credit, but won't vote for it.